things about food. Some Muslims believe that uh, you cannot eat predator fish like the shark. They say it is haram. I get a lot of these questions asked. Crustaceans. These are some examples about foods that are really myths. Uh, I have to say though that some schools of thought have made an, uh, a little exception about crustaceans. Um, you know, like, like uh, shellfish, crabs and things like that. But the majority of the scholars have said that all of this is halal and there is no text in the Quran or in the Sunnah from Prophet that tells us crustaceans are haram and the Prophet did say the hadith is in Bukhari which means Al-Bahr, the ocean, when he talked about the ocean all of its water is clean Al-Hil Maytatuhu anything that comes out of it dead or alive, even dead so you don't have to slaughter the fish when you take it out it is halal. And there is another hadith in Sahih Muslim when the Muslims were coming back from Tabuk, I think, and they found a big whale washed to shore. It was dead. And they didn't know whether to eat from it or not. They said it was massive. And they were very hungry, so they ate from it. And they said it was so huge that we can crouch inside of the eye socket. That's how big it was. And we said to the Prophet, we ate from it, Ya Rasulullah, because of necessity. And we don't know if it was halal or haram, it was dead. And he said, do you have any more of it? And they said, yes. He said, give me some. And he ate some. He ate some, which is called a sunnah taqririya. This is a fiqh terminology. Sorry, if you don't know what it means. It's a sunnah which the Prophet ﷺ affirmed. So we are allowed, inshaAllah.